Quarantine measures have hit those who are already vulnerable the hardest. In Eastern Ukraine, where hostilities take place, lack of freedom of movement has hampered people's rights to health, food, family life and social security. Throughout the country, the Roma community has told us about the worsening of their already limited access to water and sanitation, food, healthcare and social security. The vulnerability of women and girls to gender-based violence has increased due to an erosion of their financial independence and quarantine-imposed confinement. This negative impact is particularly painful for those living in isolated communities and along the contact line in eastern Ukraine. Furthermore, homeless people face a significant challenge accessing even basic facilities and resources during the coronavirus pandemic. If everyone, the government, civil society and private sector, put human rights front and center to this crisis, we have a chance to foster a more inclusive societal COVID-19 response, not only in the region where I work in, but also throughout the world.